Fun, fun, and more fun. Well, I am Selena, aka Soyube. And I'm Tutti, aka TT. And we got so much content for you, Yo. new presenters. Mm. Then we got the spice this season. Yo, we got money matters, we yeah. got career corners, and learning new things in general. Excited is me, mm. genuinely. But not to waste your time, you know, let's jump into it. We have Squall Gives Us Gedi. Mm -hmm. And then we have Celebrity Q&A with Marang. Then we have Pink Couch Sessions where we talk about our shows. And then we have Celebrity Games with Khoisan where we'll be eating hot wings. Yo! Then we have yours truly learning how to make hot wings. Mm -hmm. Yo! I'm so excited to see what Gedi does with those Sky Girls. Me too. <laughs> Hello there, Gibi Dua Gedi, aka Lazochi, aka Lazozo, welcoming you to Squad Games. Now, this is a game where we have two sets of girls, but it's squad, going up against each other. So, joining us today, I've got six gorgeous, gorgeous Sky Girls, as you can see, and I'm gonna ask them to introduce themselves. Right after that, share with us what we're going to do. Hi guys, it's your favorite girl, Jasmine Diaz. I'm going to show you education and I'm going to show I go by the name Katao Khari, hashtag beauty with brains. Shoka good grades, shapuka smoking. It's your girl, Tembi M official, and I'm going to creativity and I'm going to backstabbing. Love to see it. Hi everyone, my name is Katawa Katawa underscore Muso. Kishoka good friendships, Kishapoka drugs. Hi guys, it's your favorite girl, Zinze. Kishoka and Ibuka, Kishapoka Musha. Hi guys, my name is Ibuka Prince, Kishoka family, Kishapoka toxic friendships. Before I get into the game, guys, I need to know your squad names. What is your squad name? Team DRK. Yes, girl. Yes. What does Team DRK mean? Zinze, Rika, Katawa. And what is your squad name? Lady Queen. Where's that from? Beauty. Passion. And ambition. We're playing a game which is called Pictionary, okay? So picture dictionary, except this time around, I give you a box here. You pick a word and then you draw it. Your team members have to guess it correctly. You only have 30 seconds to do this. Yeah. Do you understand? Yeah. Yes. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Yes. 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 So right here, we've got our box, and it's got all the words. Katero has got our time already, and we're gonna start it off with the Millennium Queens. Okay, yeah, let's go. go. 30 seconds, your time is on. A window. A window. No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's go. A ball. Is that a pizza? Fame, Katero, you time. got it. Time. 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 I don't even remember. Katao <laughs> 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 from Team DRK, we're gonna hand it over to you, Katao from Melanin Queens. Sai am my soul. You just need to get here. Huh? Is the time already? Yep. Okay, let's get the, the words rolling. Pizza. Basketball. Basketball. Soccer ball. Beach ball. Pumpkin. And I. And potato. <laughs> <laughs> you can't <laughs> you can't <laughs> no. No, go in Flower. Flower. Time. Time. Uh, well done. So that is our round one coming to an end. It looks like Team DRK is leading this round. Congratulations, my girls. Now we get into round two. Let's go. Church. <laughs> Cup. Car. Car. What's that? Church. A truck. Truck. Yeah. Pesce. Me go. Yo. Fasty. What's that, Jessica? Hanger. Tree. Flower tree. Time. Time. Yeah. That was the end of round two for our Melanin Queens. 
toilet, guys. It's a toilet! Oh, it's a toilet. It's a toilet. It's a toilet. And then what was this? <laughs> Alarm. Alarm. It's a toilet. 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 It's Christmas house, tent. Okay. Time. So we've come to the end of our game. Yeah. The winner. Give it up for Team DRK. Thank you so much for joining us for another edition of Squad Games. We hope to see you soon. My name is Lizozo. Signing out. <laughs> Yo, bro. Next time I'm bringing my squad, uh, and it's gonna not. be on like Donkey Kong. Hey, but anyway, congratulations to DKR, man. They won everything. Mm. I was like, Yo, that will be me Fun next times. season. But after the ad break, yeah. we have our very first celeb Q and A of Ooh. the season with Marang and our faves, Brie Baby. <laughs> Hey Ska Ska Girls, hey Ska Ska Girls, it's Brie Baby and we are back. Hi Sky Nation, it's Bridget Hotang and welcome back to our favorite celebrity Q&A, bringing to you rare gems and inspirations. Today our guest is very, very special, special to me of course, from a child star to a mother to a wife, as if that is enough. A businesswoman, who else can it be if it's not our big sister, Marang Selolwane? Hey! Hi, Miss S. Hi, Sky Girls fam. How Hi, are you? Bree. I'm Hi. good. You look gorgeous. Thank you so much. You look so beautiful. Thank you. It's nice to have you here. It's an honor to be here. We love you. We love you. We love you. We love you. <laughs> Would you like to introduce yourself mm -hmm. and give you your chapeaus and your shows? Okay, I'm Marang Sololwane. Was Mulusiwa, but now I'm married, so I've changed my surname. I am a live performance educator, television presenter like you, Come on. actress, <laughs> and digital content creator. That's so nice. You're doing mm -hmm. everything. Like I said, guys, she's navigating through it all and doing it well. Thank you. Keshoka and Keshapokaing, right? Keshoka, good friends, right? Keshoka, positive thoughts about myself, right? My girl. <laughs> Keshoka education. The girlies must be educated. Get the girlies back. must study, okay? And then Keshapuka smoking. Ma'am, keep that thing away from don't me. Do that. Keshapuka not taking care of my mental health. Mm. Then Keshapuka and Keshapuka bad friends. I want you to do bad things, yeah. bad influences. No, 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 no. Yeah. Miss me. Being the child star that you are, mm -hmm. how was it growing up in the public eye? Well, I started when I was 11 years old, so I was a preteen. That's very many years ago. But it was good, it was good in that, listen, it had its positives, it also had its negatives, but I'm one person who likes to, get at, to look at the good. And with that, it made me very aware of my environment, very aware of myself. I knew that I had to protect my reputation, protect my image, so I always made sure that I kept good friends. I always made sure that I went to the, the right places, the age appropriate places, you know. I always made sure that I didn't get myself involved in things that would get me in trouble. You know, so it's just not like you know what? It's a blessing. This yes, a blessing. it was. It was it really a blessing. Helped. It really helped me to stay away from bad things yeah. because I was like, I have to protect my reputation and I have to protect my job. Guys, one thing about Marang, she inspires me. Uh, she does it. Oh well, you wear you so, so many hats, and congratulations on the new journey that she just started. You're getting your master's degrees all the way in South Africa. How do you juggle everything? I wake up very early. I wake up at four. Yeah. <laughs> Get in two hours of study time, and then six o'clock I start my day. It's discipline and time management. I'm not always consistent, but I try. Every single day I try. It's all about the effort, sis. Yeah. But I mean, you are booked and busy. Oh, <laughs> hell You are doing everything. Thank but you. I'm sure there's one thing that you like the most. Which one is your favorite? <gasps> It's seasonal. Sometimes I enjoy teaching more than I do content creation. Yeah. But right now, I'm really, really loving my content, because, or rather my social media audience and my social media um, job, because it allows me. It's allowed me to create a, a community of women who support each other. You know, of young professionals who share tips and you know knowledge about different things. So I'm enjoying. I'm really, really enjoying my social media. Any piece of advice to a sky girl out there? Mm. Okay. So first things first. 
be kind, right? I know a lot of us want to be, you know, great in what we do and we want to shine, but you know, the best kind of person that you want to interact with is a kind person, especially now where we're all going through things. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you love Marang. Please make sure you do follow her on her Instagram, but don't be the top fan because that's my <laughs> bad. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for coming to the Celebrity Q&A. Catch you next time. Brie Baby is out. <laughs> Yo! I loved Marang's answers and she's so pretty! I know right, being an influencer and a brand, a mother too, mm. wow! And I love that she stays true to herself. Speaking of true to yourself, uh -huh. Sky's brand is Shokayone and Shapokayone. Let's get into the pink couch sessions where our Sky girls will take us the most common Sky shorts. <laughs> Hello, hi everyone. My name is Bonola Gilebamang and here I am with Lido Katakang and Les Ratedi. Welcome to the Pink Couch Sessions, where we sit down to discuss the most important issues facing teenage girls, give our thoughts and advise each other. Today we'll be talking about a very important thing to our Sky girls, our biggest shows. Well, we all know that Sky, S-K-Y, stands for Shokayone and Shapokayone. Shokayone being the things that you love, the things you live for, the things you are passionate about, and and Shapokayone being the things you don't want to find yourself associating with. Well, I'll go first. My biggest shows are Kishoka happiness, Kishoka self love, Kishoka self care. Self care, get out of the outing, you know, take yourself out, go get a drink, you know, take care of your face, give yourself some love. And what about you guys, my lovies? My <laughs> Kishoka happiness, Kishoka yes. self confidence, and Kishoka self love. What about you, babe? Nunca hulta na tota hela Kishoka self confidence, self respect, and self care, like you said. I think when it comes to the whole self confidence thing, yes. I used to struggle yeah. when I was younger, and I feel like I'm really trying to figure out who I am, and it's good, yes. you know. No, yeah, we have done for you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but there's something I wanted to know. Why is it so important to to define our show? Did it too say young, you know? Yeah. Why should we say they're important, they hold significance to yeah. us? But Chami, let me tell you. Yeah. Like it's important to define our shows because it just gives us the sense of finding out what we enjoy, mm. what yeah. defines us, mm. what kore, that sense of belonging. Yeah. Yeah. So like, yeah, because it just reminds me of a time when I was really struggling with self-love shape. Mm. Like I felt like I was too big and I didn't belong. Mm -hmm. But like after some time I just grew to love myself the way I am because people will love me for you me. So yeah. Love yourself, girl. Yeah. Yeah. Beautifully mm. said. I agree. And I think it also helps us as young women. And just defining our identities and having a strong sense of self you know what i mean yeah yes. being a teen in general is difficult in part because you're figuring out who you are yeah. and what you stand for and exactly. we are big big advocates for figuring that out making yeah. informed choices and just doing what you love yeah, yeah. i agree yeah. with you guys you have a right to your shows you have a right to work on your shows mm. because you need to do some work on yourself right yeah. Yeah. you yeah. better yeah. can make yourself feel good yeah. but actually it is a fact that over forty thousand girls Girls have signed the Sky Pledge. They have identified their shapos, their shows, and we have been able to compile the common shows being guys drum roll, <laughs> <laughs> music, friends, and our future. But how I do look common? Right, talking the king. I just feel like these are common things that all teenagers, teenagers love. And that the hell, just a word of advice: be practical and intentional when it comes to your dreams. Yes. Write it down. Not that the hell like a shock my success. What yeah. does that yeah. look like? What does that mean? And what did it, what would it mean for you to actually actualize and materialize those dreams? Yo, yeah. I hear you. Lou, you said self love. I wanted to know exactly. What are the things that you say self love or writing? Do you sit down? Do you journal? Yeah. 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 You know what? Actually, I used to vent to one of my friends. They're like, okay, today I did this about myself. Like yeah. today I didn't cry because people commented on me. Yeah. And like, you know, also having someone to listen to you helps because yeah. they're there. Yeah. You know, so it's like, mm. okay. Mm -hmm. This is working for me, mm -hmm. so that's what I did. Yeah, yeah, no, guys. When it comes to the things that the Sky Girls love, mm -hmm. be it music, Her. be it friends, and their future reign supreme. Her. We are here Her. for it, really, ladies. We mm -hmm. are there for you. Something as small as remembering your shows and shoppers can help you define them. Can help you be yourself. Mm -hmm. Join our convo and let me know what are your biggest show. We're not TV link. What is your <laughs> well, biggest show? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so next time, my love is bye. 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 Wait, see, it's very important to know your shores. Hey, girl, tell me about it. Kind of when you know your shores, yeah. it's easier to stay true to yourself. Man, 
I know my show from this episode. I hope you youth at home know yours too. Mm -hmm. But coming up after the break, yeah? we have Koi San having hot wings. In studio, they're going to be playing a little game, answering some questions. I need to see. Hey. Wait, hot wings, uh -huh. games, celebrities. Hey, Monata, guys. Yo. Yo. Hey. Get back with us after the break. Hello, hello, everybody. My name is Oratila Kofa from Khoisan. And my name is Tawara Sofapo from Khoisan. My three shows would be music, positivity, and growth. My shapos would be smoking, bad energy, and negativity. My three shapos would be uh, smoking, bad energy, obviously, and uh, what else? Party in totality. And my three shows would be family, music, and consistency. Today, we'll be trying the Hot Wings Challenge. We will be asking each other a couple of questions yeah. while trying out the hottest. <laughs> Let's go. I guess we will be starting with the Maybe, Maybe hot. <clears throat> start. I start. Mm -hmm. If you had to listen to one song for the rest of your life, okay, what would it be? Press and tell Sorry, not sorry. Hot. Sorry, not sorry. Yeah. What is the longest time you have gone without singing? <laughs> I'm All always time. singing. Yep. The truth about it. All right. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna move on to. Flaming, flaming hot. Well, <laughs> stop being dramatic. I'm not even being dramatic. I'm just coughing like a normal human being. Hmm. Oh. This is nice. Let me ask you a question. Okay, go ahead. This is a little bit personal. Go ahead. Why did you and your last partner break up? I messed up. That's why. Messing up is two sides. I don't want to just, you know, mm. make the story long, but it has two sides. Yeah. So either you turn around and fix it, or you just carry on with being the man that you were when you broke our heart. I decided otherwise. What is the worst reason you've been dumped for? Huh. I don't know how this is going to sound. I just look at that view. Yeah. That would I'm being. Like Let's move on to the next. Why did the other members leave the group? It was somewhat a, a mutual agreement. Yeah. Well, we've been getting that We were about. a group of five people who had the same dream. Well, when, yeah. But I mean, along the way, okay, it's not working out. Gonna, it's okay. Maybe I want to try out an adventure out as a solo artist. It's okay. Yeah. So it was somewhat a mutual agreement. Let's just, you know, kind of like hot ways in a way. Disband. Yeah, it's hey, disbanding. Just disband. Just try to see what I can figure out on my yeah. own and stuff like. And was, you know, the thing about it is like, there's no bad blood. Mm. Nobody hates anybody for anything. One more question for Tabang. Mm -hmm. sure. Um, what career would you choose if you weren't a musician? I would be a musician if I wasn't a musician. For me, music is not just, you know, being a being having a gift that you can use to appease people or entertain people. Mm. For me it's a lifestyle and I believe for both of us it's more like a lifestyle. You know that you, um, there could be a possibility that uh, music might not work out the way I want it to and then I would want to pursue this. But for me it's not just music. It's like what I was born to do, right? What I was born to be doing. And that's how you establish your significance. Not just in your life, but in other people's lives as well. And here we are back again after such uh, incredible torture. But uh, nonetheless, no regrets. Thank you so much from Kwesan. That's me and this beautiful lady standing right next to me. And with no regrets whatsoever, Level two. we are signing out. Once and for all. Big thank you to the Sky Girls crew. We love you guys. Until next time. Kwesan. could still down those wings like they were nothing. My guy, strong, independent woman. Hey, aren't you going
going to be with us another strong independent woman in the S next segment bro speak of which i'll be in the kitchen making wings with natasha siku mm. herself bro. stay tuned to see what happens <laughs> Hi guys, gorgeous, gorgeous girls eat wings, hot babes eat hot things. I am here today with the boss babe herself, Natasha Siku, the owner of Wing It On. How are you doing? Hi Selena, how are you? I am amazing, how are you sis? Good. So please, what are your shows and your shuffles? Wait, let me start with my shows. Okay. Shoka success, Keshoka Maidi, Keshoka work ethic, Keshapoka laziness, Keshapoka maga, and Keshapoka smoking. Yeah. Definitely, I agree with you. Mm -hmm. Please tell me about Wing It On and yourself. Okay. So, like you said, my name is Natasha. Yes. Natasha Siku. I am, I always say, I'm an athlete first. So, my first love is sport. I'm a national netball and tennis player. I've been playing sports since I was nine. Okay. Wing It On was started in August 2020 during the pandemic, like literally in the midst of the pandemic when sports was discontinued. So we were oh. told we're not allowed to play sport anymore and we need to stay home. Then I started Wing It On. Um, I was able to get a tennis scholarship to the US. And while I was there, I got to experience wings in a wide like range. Okay, great. So please tell us the process of making your wings. All right, from beginning to end. Please. <laughs> okay. All right, so we obviously first start with uncooked chicken wings. Okay. Raw chicken wings. And we um, like coat them uh -huh. with our little secret recipe. So because we, we deep fry them, we obviously should have turned the fryer on so that the oil gets hot. All right. We dump them into the fryer. Them yeah, no, we just throw them in there. Right. And they just fry, fry, fry for about between 8 to 12 minutes, right. depending on how big the wings are. Sometimes the wings are smaller than usual, sometimes they're bigger. Okay. So it's between 8 to 15 minutes, just so we're on the safe side. Okay. Yeah. And then after that, we go back to the order board, where Selena's order is actually very precise. Okay. Since we have like 12 flavors, Selena is allowed to mix and match whatever flavor she wants. Okay. So if she's ordering 20 wings, you can mix and match five or four flavors. So you can get like uh, five, five honey barbecue, five spicy barbecue, five whatever the case may be. Right. And I'll just walk you through the sauces right now. Mm, okay. I will actually start with the honey barbecue, right. which is very popular, um, probably a bestseller. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, Th so this is mild. So oh, this, this mild. Yeah, of, right. of these four, it's mild. And then the spicy barbecue. So it's a barbecue with a little bit of a kick. Okay. Um, we have the Asian zing. Mm -hmm. This is also like a sweet kind of gingery soy. Ooh. If you're feeling a little Asian. Okay. Um, and then we have the big boy. Ah, this two is, with the big boys, eh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you want to chill, come here. Ah, with the big boys. So this is mango habanero. All right. The most spicy. Like, it, not even spicy, dude. It's like, hot. this is hot. Okay. Yeah. Um. So then after that, you know, we kind of, we based, we based the sauce on the, on the wings. Okay. We don't baste and then fry, but we fry and then baste. Okay. So we kind of then coat it with All the, right. with the sauce. And then, um plate it with any of your sides any of the sides that we have that you have picked mm, okay so, and then it just comes out as this great meal and then we just wait for you to be swept off your feet and want to come back but for now this is your girl selena bay saying bye how those wings taste eh? ma'am they were delicious mm -hmm. <laughs> wing it on wings are highly recommended hey. i won't lie to you i'm me Look, I'm sorry, but I'm so excited for this season, Girl. man. Like, can you believe it? No. We're back. Everything is big and better. Yo, this episode is over, guys. Comment on our socials at SkyGirlsBW on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, and YouTube how you felt about this episode. I mean, I'm feeling amazing. Same. <laughs> Catch us same place. Same time next week on, on the, the mix. mix. Peace out. 
I pledge to be true to myself and what I believe in, to be confident in who I am and not let anyone define me. I will say shock Kayone to the things I'm all about like music, friendship and my future. I will say shapo Kayone to the things I'm good without like negative vibes, smoking and peer pressure. I will make choices that are true to me. I pledge to define my sky. <laughs>